don't forget to check out my Patreon where you can get exclusive access to all my picks and all my trades before they hit the market and before they hit YouTube. Most of you guys are probably wondering why I haven't made a video on this, but this is something that is pretty crazy, okay? I'm gonna be trying to cover every single basis of Dogecoin information because I know I did take a couple of hours off yesterday. You know, sue me. It's all right, guys, I'm back. But as you guys can see here, okay, look at this tweet, okay? This tweet is pretty insane, okay? It says Doge slash Ethereum bridge per Vitalik. Now, if you don't know who Vitalik is, this is the guy that created Ethereum. You heard that right? This guy created Ethereum, okay? Now, some people don't like him, okay? Some people don't like him. That that's fair enough. But some people do. Okay, you know, either side, the guy created, um, you know, Ethereum. One of the co-founders of Ethereum. Um, he's a billionaire now because, of course, you know, when you create Ethereum and you own a lot, you know, you're a billionaire. But um, yeah, right now, okay, uh, what we do have, okay, is something very interesting. Okay, and this is why I always say, okay, Dogecoin is one of the most interesting altcoins to hold. Seriously, guys, look at this. Okay, it says Ethnode in a space by SpaceX. Elon Musk with a breakup meme a post and choosing another. The timeline is getting stranger by the minute. These could all be coincidence, but again, it's a reach. The breadcrumbs are there. Now remember, okay, if you've been paying attention to the YouTube channel, you'll know that Elon Musk has tweeted stuff in the past, okay, about Bitcoin and about Dogecoin. But when he's tweeted stuff, it's never been a blanket statement. Sometimes it has, sometimes it hasn't. Now, when it hasn't been a blanket statement, people have always had to dive in to see exactly what has been talking about you know for example you know sometimes it's a reach for example the word cum led to the cum rocket crypto spiking 85 percent now of course i'm guessing that this is not what he talked about okay or probably not the meme but sometimes he does leave insane breadcrumbs like he basex um breadcrumb that he left a while back now with this tweet okay basically this shows us, okay, that SpaceX is to deploy the first Ethereum node in collaboration with Space Chain. So this week, SpaceX will launch an Ethereum node to the International Space Station, making it the first time an Ethereum node has been launched into space. SpaceX been, has been hired by Space Chain to deliver the cargo and International Space Station. The launch of the ETH node is aboard the International Space Station, will be accompanies the company's fourth blockchain payload to enter orbit, according to Space Chain. It will serve as a demonstration of the integration of Ethereum technology with its hardware on the international space station so this is crazy okay because this means okay that you know cryptocurrency is truly becoming decentralized with these kind of moves now okay as you guys can see right here we also have this tweet okay dogecoin is vitalik's most profitable investment ever vitalik loves dogecoin and thinks that it should be top three in market cap now remember when we talked previously about market cap okay what do we have here guys if Dogecoin is to be a top three cryptocurrency by market cap, this would put its market cap, okay, at above, okay, Binance Coin, meaning that Dogecoin would probably be at around the 50, 70 dollar, not 50, 70 dollar, 50 cent, 60 cent dollar mark. So as you guys can see right now, okay, price of Dogecoin, okay, isn't that high compared to what it previously was. But if it's top three, okay, it's gonna be above Tether, meaning that the price of Dogecoin is like, if it's a top three cryptocurrency, guys, that is literally insane news. Now, okay, if we go back to this tweet, not that tweet, but if we can see here, it says bi-directional trustless bridge for Doge slash ETH is feasible and Dogecoin could be merge mined with Ethereum 2. Now, if you don't know what Ethereum 2 is, Ethereum 2 is basically the improved version of Ethereum. Now, basically, Ethereum has a whole host of insane issues, okay? And now 2.0, is the point that Ethereum needs the upgrade. Now, of course, the point is, okay, is that cryptocurrency over time, it needs to be improved, it needs to become better, more efficient, less transactions, less transaction fees, and more transaction speed. Now, Ethereum currently, to send transactions when the Ethereum network is being used highly, it costs around $150, which is absolutely ludicrous. Imagine you've got to send a payment to your friend, okay, and it costs literally $150 to send that payment. You would call it daylight robbery, okay? And this is a problem with the Ethereum network. Now, Ethereum 2.0 solves many of these issues, and Ethereum 2.0 is, is something that's going to increase, especially as fees and scalability. Now, basically, the bombshell that this is, okay, is probably insane, okay? It, it, it's a reach, but, okay, this is something crazy. Apparently, this could be a merge with Dogecoin and Ethereum 2.0. So, as you guys can see here, you know... The Ethereum creator, Vitalik, okay, does actually love Dogecoin, okay? Remember, this guy is, is a leader in Shiba, okay? I'm not sure if he created him in Shiba Inu. Recently, he sold over a billion dollars, okay, worth of Shiba Inu to donate to India. That's a pretty notable crypt cryptocurrency donation. That is something that I think we can all, you know, clap our hands at and say, you know what? That's decent and it's a very charitable thing. But the point I'm trying to make, okay, is that 
This is something insane, okay? And I don't see a lot of people talking about this, okay? This tweet has 350 likes, okay? And I'm thinking that potentially, okay, what we could see, okay, is Dogecoin and Ethereum. Now, I'm not gonna sit here and lie to you guys and explain every single thing about the blockchain because the blockchain is very, very complicated. Um, I'm still doing research. I'm still learning about all the stuff, all the stuff in DeFi, but potentially it looks like there's gonna be some potential collaborations between Ethereum, Dogecoin, um, with the next stages. Now you understand, okay, that SpaceX is owned by Elon Musk. Okay, Ethereum is, you know, owned by Vitalik. And of course, okay, I'm guessing that potentially there could be some kind of merger. Now you might be wondering, okay, recently, okay, if you've been paying attention to the channel, you'll know, okay, that a couple days ago, okay, and this is something interesting as well. And this is why I say pay attention, guys. Look at what we have here, okay? If we scroll down, Okay, you guys can see, okay, that there's a weird tweet here. So it says Ethereum co-founders highlights the importance of decentralization in response to Elon Musk's tweet regarding Doge scalability. Now, this is basically, okay, the Vitalik guy, the guy that we just talked about, okay, and Elon Musk is saying he fears the Doge. I'm not sure, okay, what is going on here because when, it, when, when you have something like this, when you have Elon Musk, okay, bridging the gap, okay, for cryptocurrency to be scaled even more effectively with the SpaceX node, okay, you know, for, for, for this kind of thing to be happening, okay, where, you know, Elon Musk, Elon, where he's saying that Elon Musk's plan for scaling crypto is fundamentally flawed, it's kind of weird, okay? So, you know, for Violet Alec, not to be bashing, but for him to be saying that, you know, it won't work is a bit weird if there is a potential for them to be working on something. Now, could this be something that actually happens? I think it is. I do think it is simply because, um, you know, we've seen weird stuff in the past, but at the end of the day, okay, I don't think Vitalik is someone that is has a, he might have a huge ego, I don't know him personally, but the point I'm trying to make, okay, is that if it came to helping Dogecoin be developed, okay, and it looks like, you know, Elon Musk is already helping if the, if the Ethereum network by adding a node to the space, to the space station, guys, which is absolutely insane. So if we see, okay, and like Ethereum slash Dogecoin collaboration or something to where Dogecoin is bridged with the Ethereum network, okay, or merge mined with Ethereum 2.0, okay, that is going to be absolutely insane. And that is going to be the 10x uh, the, the 10x catalyst guys. So remember, okay. Remember, okay. That Dogecoin is literally going to be the first cryptocurrency on the moon. Okay. And that is something that is absolutely insane. So I would say, okay, that this is something that you guys need to pay attention to. And this is something, okay, that I am storing and something that I'm paying attention to because I know that nobody's going to be talking about this stuff on YouTube. They're just going to be talking about the daily price movements, but this is the stuff, the back end stuff that you have to pay attention to because stuff like this, okay, I covered ages ago and doesn't get that much views. And then people will see, oh my God, Elon Musk actually was doing this and this and that. And you could have seen this stuff if you paid attention. So with that being said, of course, Elon Musk has been on a rampage lately on Twitter. You know, he's been tweeting some crazy, crazy stuff. And you know, I, I think I'm going to make a video where I talk about the manipulation of, of Elon Musk and Bitcoin and all that stuff, because there have been too many tweets, okay, that have been timed to perfection. So I'm going to be talking about that in another video. But guys, please let me know if you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you, you know, you liked it. But um, yeah, um, as you guys can see, um, I'm going to be talking about a lot of this stuff in another video. So if you guys um, enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.